of Ferguson. Why is this controversial Patriot group on the streets there, and who are they protecting? And a real sex scandal with a fake cover-up. Why a politician lied, making up an affair with a male prostitute. Very difficult to follow this wild web that he's it weaving. Is. What more are you learning about? This it story? is a complicated story that's difficult to understand. Much more amazing than fiction in this situation. So, how was it eventually uncovered that this lawmaker was the person behind the email, not somebody else? A former aide secretly recorded a conversation in which Corsair tried to convince him. So, state investigators, they're looking at this. Good luck to them in trying to figure out what's up and down here. Is he actually going to be able to keep his job? Well, he is again, again, declined to resign. He says he won't use to cover up this alleged affair, and if it was, he could face charges. Right, because even though the, the most amazing part of the story is the cover up and the affair right. and everything like that, that actually isn't a violation of his job. He can right. keep his job just right. for having an affair, but if he uses state money or state property, that's going to get him. Also important to note, the other representative, uh, Cindy Gann, asked about the leaking of the slight bulletin. They say that they are not concerned. Is it, how big of a deal is this, though? This, this is a very big deal. I mean, the White House is, is uh, trying to minimize the threat um, and, and really lower the expectations right. of, of what that, you know, uh, the... Inside those conversations amongst the Secret Service, who's in charge now of the plan, what, what needs to be adjusted? So it, the, the... Really, a lot needs to be adjusted. It's really? not just the... Totally. I mean, so, you know, if you have to adjust the president's arrival time, that really, you know, will change what our emergency... These are these plans have been going, you know, uh, being developed for weeks by by the agents on the ground, the advanced team, in coordination with the White House staff, White House military office. Now all of a sudden, have taken. I mean, when you, especially when you look, that says something. When you look at all the trips, the places that he has gone, why is this so dangerous? Well, let's you know compare this to like some of the war zones that he's gone into. Yeah, uh, he's gone to Afghanistan and to Iraq. Those were unannounced. I mean, just by the airstrikes that they're launching right now is an indicator of that. So people that want to do harm have been planning for a long time. Um, this is a uh, widely publicized uh, you know, a trip for them. It's very personal to the president. Mm -hmm. it's, it's the people you're working with on the ground is the U.S. military versus the people you're working with on the ground are Kenyan, the, the Kenyan military. Absolutely. Yeah. The Secret Service has to rely on our local counterparts all throughout the world to get our job done. Mm -hmm. And it's just what is, the, what is that uh, you know, level of expectation from those counterparts that we can rely on? Jonathan, thank you so much. Thank you. Coming up for us, we have breaking news today.